Thanks, Joe. Thanks for taking the time to talk with us today. How does that feel? It must be a good, a good wrap up for the year. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's it's my last show of the year, and haven't had the best of end end of year with all my horses this year. Um, they're all sort of at the stepping up stage, so they're all sort of plateauing out a little bit because they're all so young. Um, but they're all been jumping so good all year. Um, and yeah, I'm really happy to win the, the Triple Crown. It's such a good idea. I think the team's done um, for, for all, all of the series. So it's really it's really well thought of and stuff like that. And I think all of, all of us riders are sort of support for next year as well. Um, and yeah, I'm really really lucky to have the, the owners from Yulambi Farm, Rory and Sue Hobble, to to support me with all my horses that I have um, and yeah I'm really happy to come out with the ground series for the, for the mini free. What a fantastic location that you've got here for the, the grand final. Yeah it's amazing, Terry Snow's done, done such a great job. I've been here a few times for the dressage um, but even since then, since I've been, was here last time and since now it's, everything's changed completely again, it's all a bit of a new revamp and stuff like that so I think as riders we couldn't be any happier. And I think we've got I think there's some more work going ahead. I think they've got a new a new arena. Yeah, yeah, I think they've got a new jumping arena put in. They're getting put in a surface one, so that'll be good. So it doesn't really matter if it rains then like this year, but um but I think the I think the whole crew did such a good job with the grass arena and they couldn't have tried any harder. I think like Tim says he wants to please all of us riders so and that's what it's all about I suppose. Oh, that's great. And I guess you have a bit of a break now, the horse is having a bit of a break over Christmas. Yeah, I'd like to give them a probably a month off, um, to go in the paddock and just let down a little bit. Um, like I said they've all had such a big big hard year but I've got such a great team at the moment. Um, so I've got some very exciting horses and I sort of yeah, really, really happy, looking forward to the future with them. Um, so, yeah, it could be happier. Yes, and have you got um, next year, have you got a few sort of goals you want to next year? You... Um, some of the horses will step up to World Cup next year. So I think next year I'll have a team of probably four World Cup horses. So can't really complain about that. That's sort of a lot of people struggle sometimes. They're, everyone's good enough rider, I think. But sort of they lack in the horse department. So, yeah, I can't complain with all the owners and the support of my, fa of my family and stuff like that. So, um, and possibly, we'll see how they're all going, maybe America next year is in the, in the cards. Okay, well, it's fantastic, Tom. And congratulations again on such a brilliant year. It's been really great. And thanks for all the stories. Cool. Uh, we appreciate it. We wish you all the best and have a lovely Christmas. Thanks, Joe. Thank you. Thanks.